Pachuco culture to me is style as resistance. It's uh, pride, self-care. It's a way for us to connect our, our family, our ancestors, and our community. And to be able to do that with style is even better. I can showcase my art in hats, and they have a meaning to it. The imagination, it's just not putting together some felt and putting a ribbon on it. The process of custom making these hats is unbelievable. We are located in Los Angeles, um, just under the 6th Street Bridge. You wouldn't know it was here um, unless you asked. Our clientele is really diverse. It's not just Chicanos and Mexican Americans or Mexicans. We've made hats for uh, important people in the community and also celebrities, uh, people who sing in uh, La Maldita Vecindad, the Pscal Band, La Santa Cecilia, Madonna has uh, ordered a couple of my hats too. I originally was making hats for myself and uh, friends started asking me for you know hats off my head and, and generously or maybe lubed up with <laughs> a drink or two. I said yes, uh, please have it and then eventually started a Instagram account and just started showing the behind the scenes. Just propped up a tripod and said this is what I'm doing and had so many inquiries of where they can purchase this hat or where they can find uh, my shop. And I knew that something was happening here that I did not expect. It's just this magical place. You walk in and uh, you can't believe it. It's tucked in this strange little area here in Boyle Heights. I happen to own a red uh, zoot suit and complete with hat and red feather. I don't get to wear it often, I will say. Very special occasions, but yeah, I, I, I love the Pachuco culture. I love seeing that the culture is, is not emerging because it never went away, but it is certainly really and being celebrated like some, today. Yes. And the wonderful thing is how people like Iberto with his wife, Cynthia, are honoring the tradition, but making it their own. I'm not a great painter or uh, tattoo artist or anything like that, so my canvas is a felt hat. When we do a custom piece for a client, they speak of what it, it means to them. I think my art is like uh, a tattoo, that it's not in your body, but you're gonna wear it with so much pride. I stumbled upon Bachuco Supply on Instagram. I was looking to get a gift for my brother. I talked to him about creating a hat together and then gifting it to him for his birthday. The whole process was great. It was such a great creative process and got to add elements to my personality, of our family. For me, one of the points of pride and one of the things that really always touches my heart is when someone comments or sends me a message, man, my father would have loved that spot. Your hats remind me of my grandfather or my father. And the reason why is because what I'm doing is creating something that reminds me of my father and um, it's, it's keeping his spirit alive. So everything just made sense that I would identify with this, this culture of, of Chicano.